Welcome to my video update on the development progress for the Steam VR simulation of the 1851 Great Exhibition. We start this update with this colossal urn made of porphyry, manufactured at the Porphyry Works at Elfdal. It was exhibited by Oscar I, King of Sweden and Norway. After the exhibition it was gifted to Prince Albert. The fate of this urn is unknown. Moving west, we pass a six-pound field cannon, manufactured at the Akers Foundry, Mariefred, Sweden. Continuing west, we come to Boy with Swan, by Erdman Theodore Kallide. Several copies exist of this piece. This is a model of the copy located in Maciejki Square, Chorzo, Poland. Many thanks to Zachowito.eu for allowing us to use their model. The copy displayed at the Great Exhibition was acquired by Queen Victoria and Prince Albert, and is now located in the grounds of Osborne House. Continuing west, we pass the Holland section, above which are the Royal Coat of Arms of the Netherlands. As we approach the transept, we encounter the magnificent shield presented to Queen Victoria and Prince Albert by Frederick William IV, King of Prussia, who was sponsor at the baptism of the Prince of Wales, later Edward VII, at St. George's Chapel, Windsor Castle, the 25th of January 1842. Crossing the transept into the western nave, we come to the fine art court. Here we find one of several depictions of the crucifixion at the Great Exhibition. This was by William Austin of Limehouse Dockyard. We have not been able to locate the piece from the exhibition. The model here is from the treasury of the Order of the Holy Sepulchre in Macau at the Museum of Michowska Land. At the other end of the fine art court are two console tables by Thomas Woodruff of Bakewell, Derbyshire. Note the V and A in both the designs. Both these tables are now at Osborne House. And finally for this update, as we move back out into the nave, here is the magnificently decorated grand piano by John Broadwood and Sons. Unfortunately, the whereabouts of this magnificent piano are unknown, and it is feared lost. Watch out for my next video, which will continue to add to the contents of the exhibition.